Classmates are trying to cope with the tragic death of a 13 year old girl. She died in an accident at her home on Saturday. Ben Oldak visited with people who knew her. Perry Sagan's life was cut tragically short after a brick pillar she and her sister attached a hammock to collapsed, falling on top of the young girl. For many of these, these students, they haven't even lost a grandparent. So for them, they experienced death for the first time. So, so at the prayer service, it was, it was hard on them. Now students and teachers at St. Augustine's Catholic School are grieving her loss. Every child had the same question. Why, why did this happen? How could, how could God do this? Um, why, why now? And there are no, you know, we could give them no answers other than this is, this is a plan and we don't know, we don't know the plan, but we just have to pray that the family gets through it. Perry was supposed to graduate eighth grade next week, a winner of the presidential scholarship. She looked forward to a bright future. Perry was wonderful. She was very talented uh, in tennis. She was uh, played for our volleyball team. She was an honor student. She was a gymnast. She was a dancer. She was in all our musicals uh, the last three years. Um, and she always wanted to do the right thing. Now staff are discussing how to memorialize her at graduation, though they wish that there was something more they could do. You would gladly um, take their place in a, in a, in a heartbeat. Um, they're, they're wonderful kids, you know. And so when something happens like this, you just, just wish that you could, you could just exchange places.